All right guys, Bob here, and uh, I think if you cast your mind back about uh, four weeks now, uh, you'll remember me doing the unpackaging video for this, and it is the Inatech Bohemian 13-inch uh, MacBook Air sleeve, which also will take the 13-inch uh, uh, MacBook Retina Pro. And um, I just wanted to give my review on it, really. And, you know, it, it is a well-designed bag, very snug fit. I mean, you know, you've even got this pocket on the front here where you can uh, fit uh, like a MacBook Air. Now this one is in a, a case, a fairly lightweight case, but a case nonetheless. And as you can see, that just slips very easily into there. So, you know, um, not a problem there. And to get around the, uh, the situation of not having um, a pocket big enough to take uh, your power brick, they've thought of that by giving you this bag here. Um, I think, in all fairness, it is a very good quality case. And, you know, it's, it's, it's also for a very nice price, really, for such good quality. Um, if I take the MacBook Air out of it, just put that to one side a minute. Um, the, you know, the, the padding's great. The inside lining is absolutely lovely. It's like a, a really fine microfiber fleece. Um, I think the only sort of, I mean, you can see it's got a very slight discoloration, which is, you know, I expected that with this material. You know, it's a canvas material, so I was expecting some uh, slight discoloration, but I was expecting more than that. Um, so in all fairness, you know, keeping a clean hand, you're not gonna get any problems with that at all. You know, I mean, I think all of the colors actually have some fairly pale parts on them that would show that sort of thing up. But other than that, um, there's been a slight sag in the padding, very slight. Um, not enough that I would be concerned about. It's pretty much stopped now. It, it sort of sagged for its first. I mean, I've had it four weeks and I think it sort of sagged in the first week and hasn't sagged anymore. So I think that's just a case of, you know, MacBook in and out. I mean, that MacBook Air has been in and out of this sort of every day, at least once a day. So, you know, from that point of view, it's fared extremely well, really. Uh, even this is um, fared well. I was expecting that to possibly snap. That is still in extremely good condition. No wear and tear on it and it hasn't uh, pulled away from its stitching or anything either. Um, the, the fleece is absolutely lovely, still still sort of, still as smooth, not sort of lost its nap or anything like that. And um, yeah, I mean, there's not a great deal I can really, I think if there was one thing they could do to actually improve this case would be to add some form of maybe a, I don't know, a prested or something, something so you could just attach that to it. And I think that would be the only thing that I would love to see on this bag. I don't know, maybe a prested, maybe a button, maybe a way of, maybe even another one of these tags around here so you could just fasten that around the button as well. It just, you know, it's just so that you haven't got to carry that second one loose. And that's the only thing I could really sort of criticize about it. Other than that, it is a really great quality bag. And for the price, um, I think it's only about uh, 13, 14 pounds, something like that on Amazon at the minute. You just cannot complain. It's, uh, you know, I was, I, I must admit it has sort of surprised me. So, you know, that's all I can really say about it, guys. It's, it is a very nice bag, you know, great quality. Uh, I expected the canvas to show up a bit more dirt, but it hasn't. And that's it, guys. I mean, you know, it really is lovely so i mean you know do you know do do buy um with uh, with confidence really i think with this product i think is what i'm trying to say you know which uh, i've you know i've never really sort of like said that you can buy with that much sort of confidence on a product on amazon before but uh, with this one definitely so uh, yeah keep an eye out for the next video guys and i'll uh, see you in the next one cheers guys see you